in this lesson we will begin with next js okay so the first thing you want to do is create a folder where you're going to build a next project okay so here i'm going to create a new folder so make directory let's call it hello next okay let's get inside hello next and let's run npm init it will ask you a couple of questions you can just hit enter okay so it has initialized package.json file as you can see here hello next let me open with my sublime text editor okay so package.json has been created now we can start installing the packages and what we need is we need react react dom and next okay so npm install dash dash save react react dom and next and any next.js application that requires pages folder okay so let's create pages folder okay so here in our package.json we need to add a couple of scripts so let's get rid of this test script we can write dev and that dev will run next okay then the next one you want to create is build this will be next build then next you want to add start that will run next start okay so we will be running dev npm run dev that will run next okay so back to our terminal and let's run npm run dev okay okay give it a refresh and we don't see anything that's because we have created pages folder but there is nothing there okay so we don't have any files so what we need is we need at least one file called index.js okay and here we don't need to import react because uh, that comes with next by default so you can just start creating a functional component okay so const index equals to we can return something called h2 hello from next js okay and let's export default okay this is all we need now let's visit our page here let's give it a refresh as you can see here hello from next js okay so the minimum requirement is you create pages folder and inside that you create index.js file and that will be served as a default landing page okay and this is the beauty of next.js you don't need to install react router dom and configure the routing it works out of the box automatically so any page you create inside pages folder will act like a page for example if you create another page let's create another page let's call it about.js okay and here you can create the page so const about h2 about page let's export default okay okay so this is a home page we should be able to access that using about as you can see here about page okay so this is the beauty of next.js the routing system is based on the pages so any page you create here will be available as a route here so it was pretty easy now in the next lesson let's learn to navigate around pages how would we navigate do we use a tag just like a standard html or there is something more in next.js let's discover that in the next lesson thank you